emptiness you left behind Trying to sleep but the silence is haunting this room every night I can stand to feel this way My body's creeping out your name Didn't want to say goodbye to you, bye to you But you're gone It's Patriot Magnets, me and Steve are at a location. This is the first location where Steve started magnet fishing. So we're gonna hit it again out with that. See if we can get some more treats out of this place. Let's do it. The grapple first. Flipping heavy for a sandbag, that man. There you go. What we got here? Primary school bag. Bag full of this stuff, don't know what that is. Yeah, you would have metal around there. Yeah. Well not. Nah. It's got some uh, some writing on it. Interesting. Chance. Don't know what's in there, do you? There's the cold you said. Which is that? <laughs> Let's get the clamped magnet on it. <sighs> See what treats we can get. Something orange. Something orange fell off then. Look at all them key rings. No key rings, man. Something orange fell off though. Small BMX mountain bike. Bunch of jewelry there. Yeah, what's this? <gasps> oh, hi. A little BB bun. 
Oh, nice man. So go in it. Sure is. Painted black as well. So they did the paint on black on purpose, aren't they? Yeah. Gun. It looks like a shotgun shell. It's been that's been used. Can you see that? Right. And there we go. Real plan. Fresh of that. Stay. Scott's found a little hammerhead. Oh, yeah. That's nice. Lovely. Was it a watch? Uh, two watches. Is it coming from that same spot again? Uh, it's just pulled up. It's just pulled up. It's back. Alright man, it's like you got a pillowcase full of stuff mate. And my poppies fell off. We've all had a pillowcase now haven't we? Yeah, you've got loads of stuff in there. You got this camera on you. Steve's just pulled up a pillowcase full of goodies.
It's a similar area, but... Steve's found a load There's stuff here a pillowcase Quite a few watches in there isn't there? one of the bags like the other bags full of euros um, cool find man yeah I'll put it in this bag might as well unless in fact that's the steak I have got something special for that just in case we did find some chalets Luckily I brought some bags out, we can put stuff in.
on the mega hog. Hi, bad boy. Mark's bad boy. Are you bad boy? Trying to escape. Nice one, man. There we are, Steve's goodie bag there. Steve's there. Uh... On the shopping basket. <laughs> Supermarket sweep. Yeah. Hey, up, what's this? <laughs> it's getting silly now, this, isn't it? Yeah. To make sure it comes on today. Oh, you want to open yeah. Anyway, I'll have two more. How many times have we thrown in this area, Steve? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Monkey BT box. There we go. All full of sludge. And all you need to do is get that in there. If there's any money in there. And there's nothing. Got more of these key rings, and I've got a prayer one. Some key keys. You keep finding the keys, don't you? Yeah. This magnet, man. Tell you. Put a little magnet in it. Yeah. Right here. Right here. Whoa. Oh, all right. Hey, what's this here? This a wallet. It is. Yeah. 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 Licked clean. Exactly. There's some more. Oh, a bit of jewellery. That looks like a pendant, actually. Oh, it's a necklace. Nice necklace. And two P. Flipping heck! This has got to be a joke now. This, hasn't it? Look at all them on one. 
Yep, there's some more keys. Exactly, man. Look at that, what's that, that car key, isn't it? I'm on the keys today, man, I tell you. Right, so we're back home now. What a good day, me and Steve had. Only about three hours out. Uh, spare of the moment thing. So uh, that's the best thing, spare of the moment. Right, I'm going to do this in two halves again uh, because that bit over there is where the, uh, the pillowcase full of jewellery so we'll just concentrate on this bit uh, first of all there's the nice little clamp I found quite new so let's concentrate on all here all the way around the edges here is key rings and I'll just give you a couple of examples of the key rings um, the Prophet Jesus it's got a few names on basically name ones and uh, the meaning of it from the Arabic text there you go ok well, pretty much a few of them are the same a um, few names and that lot but there's 28 of them 28 key rings so I'm not going to go through them all let's pick a that one is probably a different one yeah just give you a bit of a, an inkling nail clippers let's get these coins out of the way haven't we a load of two peas for the pot Pennies. It is slightly windy, so I do apologise about the noise. And we've got two 5p's and a 10p. All together, 50p here. Right, this looks like someone's section. That's a key fob for either flats or buildings. AA. Uh, different selection of keys from like size of padlocks to probably front and back door possibly garage keys don't know so let's look fine that and this one here that should be clipped to something but obviously it's in canal um, that's a bottle opener really corroded though and that looked like a, an old car key. I don't think it's got a. Well, it's got a Renault written there actually. If it's a Renault one. And what else we got? Got these uh, hairpins, I think they are. Yeah. These are the little prayer cases. Uh, when we do go back to that part, I am going to put these back in the place where I found them. Just want to show everybody if you've never seen one of these prayer parcels. They do have them on pendants as well. Uh, what's this? A phone, possibly a burner phone. Tate, parcel tate, which have a look actually. So it's got a SIM card. Um. Where's that? It's got the nail clippers on it. Yep, so it's still got the SIM card in there. Uh, 
like a like a mobile. It's actually a nano sim in it, micro sim. Cool. Good to find out what's on there, wasn't it? You know what I mean? Right. These beads here, um, not too sure, but I think the for, for counting. Um, don't know if you do your prayers with them. I don't know. Plastic. They come up on the grapple, I think. Get close to all this jewelry afterwards. There we go. That is from. That's not got a marking on it actually. There we go. They're all magnetic, so. They are costume jewelry. This says a uh, foxy on here. That's just a simple necklace. Nice, isn't it? None of these have got any markings on. Yeah, that's quite heavy, that one. This one's quite nice. Hmm, interesting. Got a tag on it as well. Somewhere. From Claire's. Claire's accessories. The necklace. And I think this is a, a necklace as well. Yeah. There we go. Pull this up. Obviously, thought it was uh, a real one, as you can see with this bit here. You know, that's the clip, and then to release that, press this button. There we go. So you can tell it is a, a BB one. I had a little spring mechanism on the top there. It has actually got a BB in it, and I have actually. Got it to work. So all you do is cock it back like that. It's ready. And there you go. Do a little test. There we go. It's made a little mark in the polystyrene, so that actually works. Right, so we'll, uh, we'll get onto that bit now. We'll see you in a moment. Right, we're onto the final bit. So let's start off. All this was in the pillowcase, including all these euros. So first of all, the other coins that we had was the pound coin. It's just come out of circulation. And these here, it's got the United Arab Emirates on there. Cool. And there's uh, five of them. Right, I'm not going to go through all this lot. I'll put some pictures up at the end. I'll just go through a little bits and pieces. Uh, these rings. Quite interesting. It's got a stone in it. I'm not sure of any markings, so I'll have a look, see if I can find anything on there. And if I can, I'll put a picture on. And this looks like a little wedding band, but an old one. Hmm, interesting. Um, what else have we got? I mean, this is quite nice. This necklace, 
Nothing written on the back. That's quite nice. Couple of bracelets. The coins were all in one of the bags that was inside and in the other bag was this, this necklace. It's not really got any markings on it or names or anything, but that was in its own separate bag. Got a selection of mirrors here. There we go. Yay! Quite nice. Nothing with engravings on or anything. Uh, got this nice bracelet, this butterfly one. And you've got the odd little links. Oh, that's actually a necklace, so we'll show that as well. These are all the loose bits. i uh, show you a couple of these watches as well, um, this is an interesting one. I'm going to try to see if I can find this particular watch. It is a, if I get it the right way up, an Accurist. It's got quartz written there. And uh, it's got these lovely rose pictures here. It is quite a small watch, so I'm thinking that it's a, it's a lady's watch. Let's see what it says here. Uh, base metal top, stainless steel. Uh, so that's got a um, maker's number on there, it says Japan. Uh, I think this is Le Cat. Yep, seen one of them before. This is quite an old one as well, this windy one. Not too sure with the make. I think it says Seconda. Yeah, it's a seconda in there. So I'll see if we can find a, a picture of that one. Yeah, the maker actually. Um, some of these, that's another make as well. Ravel. There's a few of them with that on it. That's got Casio written on it there. This is quite interesting. Still got a bit of water in there. That's how uh, tightly it is. Um, and it says G I N G K K A R K E R. And that's actually makers of, um, I believe, fire extinguishers and safety equipment. So I'm not sure someone must have got that as a present because I'm going to try and find a picture of these watches, but I've not come across any at the moment. But I'll Keep trying. Yeah. Loras, what resistant? It's actually 12 watches in total. Another, this looks like a men's watch. Seconda. Another Ravel. Not sure what that one is because it's not dried out. Wait a minute. It says limit on it. Citron. Ah. Yeah, so you've got the other necklaces here. And this little brooch of a ladybird. This looks like a little pill box. Tape measure. Official train spotter keyring. Some nice uh, necklaces. I uh, find some marks on any of these. I'll put pictures on. A little bit of a bracelet. That as well. I don't know what that is. Possibly a bracelet. Don't know. And this one as well. 
there you go ladies and gents, that's everything for today, so hopefully we're going to be hitting this spot soon, see if we can find some more treats, and uh, thank you everything for subscribing, thank you for all your comments, um, your support, Colin's just come in, what is this as well, isn't it? yeah thank you for all, all your support, and um, yeah, well uh, we'll see you shortly, take care. You left behind Trying to sleep But the silence is haunting this room Every night I can stand to feel This way My body's creeping out Your name Didn't want to say Goodbye to you, bye to you But you're gone Oh, I wish the sun
Mm-hmm.